guys so this one is uh, just our first try sorry if you find any mistakes because this one is just with two legs i made i hope in my coming videos i will make a complete with four legs horse as well uh, i have traced a horse shape uh, from my computer i traced it on a paper and then i will stick it on the cardboard and then i will cut it according to the shape and remember uh, i know this one i made it just with two legs because it was my first try so in uh, my other video i will make a complete horse with uh, four legs how to make completely and now i will start to cut it according to the shape i draw this one is my first ever uh, video uh, in which I uh, made the uh, animal uh, there are more other ways to make the horse or anything with clay even so in my next videos I will do it completely and I will show how to make complete animal Now I will place it on other piece of cardboard and I will trace according to the shape again and I will cut it again to stick them together. Now I apply hot glue between both cardboard pieces and stick them together and then we will uh, make the rest of the things with the foil to make it uh, the real look of the horse to make it like skin type. Okay, here I have some pieces of foil you can do it with clay even but I don't have clay today so I was using the foil uh, it's more cheaper actually than clay uh, then I will uh, apply the hot glue on each and every part of the horse I draw then I will stick this foil on top of the cardboard piece do not press it a, uh, a lot just leave it fluffy little bit to be make it prominent more keep covering all the cardboard with this foil from both sides to give it a look of skin prominent Here you can see I have covered the both sides. It should be actually a little bit more thicker than I made. Uh, so if you want to try this, uh, try to cut more cardboard pieces and try to put more foil on it to make it a little bit thicker. And then I will cover the top surface also with more foil. Here it's done. You can see it will give it the shape of the horse skin like a little bit uh, muscles type showing and bones and those things and now I will take a paper tape or masking tape to cover the all foil keep covering all the horse with the small pieces of paper tape or masking tape like this it will be easier 
to give it uh, a color also on top of the tail I'm using uh, dark brown acrylic paint and I will cover all the horse with this color And then on top of this dark brown I will use a little bit light brown color just to give it a little bit shade of skin. You can use the colors of your choice as well black or light brown or even white whatever. And now I will use black acrylic paint on the feet. And I will after cover the little bit legs also until knees with the black paint as well. Now I will take white acrylic paint and I will uh, paint it on the front part of the horse. On his face from the forehead until his nose and mouth. Now again I am using black acrylic paint and I will just give it a little bit shade on top also on top of the feet. With black acrylic I will draw his nose and mouth part as well and then his eyes. And now draw the eyes a little bit different shape. For the hairs I'm using black yarn. Just cut it small small pieces. And I will stick it with hot glue on his uh, head and on the tail as well. Apply hot glue on top of the head and start to stick the yarn on top of the glue Here it's done and now once all colors are dry I will uh, use the transparent spray to give it a little bit shine and secure the colors as well. Here I'm using a transparent spray. And now here on a single piece of cardboard I will draw the rocking uh, chair part, rocking part. Here I have cut it and now again to make these pieces uh, thick you need to stick many cardboard pieces together to give it just like a wood shape or wood uh, thickness I prepare two sides and both are very thick and strong and this is horse I have spray it also it's dry now and now I will cut the rest of the sticks the part of the rocking uh, chair and 
it's not yet I even don't know exactly what to say this sorry for that I hope you understand so these uh, pieces I will stick on which the horse has to stand now take your horse and place it on these parts to check where we need to stick those uh, cardboard pieces the rest do I made just mark it like this on both pieces and then stick those two, uh, those two small uh, sticks of the cardboard on these marking points with the white glue and tissues I will cover all of this and leave them dry completely and you can see how it's rocking as well it was so much fun to make this actually and I really enjoyed it and I hope in my coming videos I will make a complete with cart as well with horse as well so let's see After it's dry, I will use all uh, colors acrylic. First, I will use the mustard color. If you want, you can just simply make it uh, brown color. But I just uh, I was trying to uh, change the color of wood actually, so I was using different shades. And now, on top of this, I will use the dark brown color a little bit. now i'm using the black because once all of these colors dry on top of the tissues it will give it a beautiful texture of wood as well but you can simply make it uh, just a simply black color or just brown color as well if you don't want to use all of these colors so here it's dry almost and now i will take a light golden acrylic paint it's not real golden shine one it's a little bit light color so I will just give it on top of the uh, other colors Here I am using a fabric for the seat. You can use even leather if you have black color. But for me whatever was available I was using. So I will cut it just a little bit a, a round shape and I will stick it on top of the horse with hot glue like this. Well, sorry people for uh, one step is missing here on which I am drawing this mustard color first I draw it with the pencil uh, because I was not having belts and those things so I will I just draw with pencil and then I color it with the mustard color where you they use the belts or the ropes for his face to tie him it's done I just made it roughly fast if you want you can use uh, even belts as well if you have the small tiny sizes for the rope as well so I will just uh, apply hot glue on his feet 
and then I will stick it on top of this rocking chair rocking toy whatever it is and here it's done I actually loved it uh, you can uh, obviously use different colors you want you can make it the horse black or leave it simply brown color and you can leave the chair rocking chair in simply brown color as well whatever so it was my first try I hope you enjoy and sorry uh, if you find any mistakes or something because it was really my first try to make an animal um, so let's see for the next video how I will make with the four legs complete animal so thank you for watching please subscribe to channel and bye for now